And hello, wherever you happen to be, it's a fine night for football here at Wembley Stadium in London. I'm Derek Ray, in position to bring you live match commentary, and my expert analyst, as always on these occasions, is Stuart Robson. And we're fully convinced this game will live up to its billing. It's England versus Hungary. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. The England first 11. Jordan Pickford stands between the posts. Harry Maguire plays alongside John Stones in central defence. Raheem Sterling plays with Phil Foden out wide. And the focal point in attack today, Harry Kane. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, as you can see, they're playing with a front two, three central midfield players and a couple of wing-backs. It's a great system when played well, but it does leave them vulnerable to switches of play. And so the battle commences. Declan Rice. Sterling has it. Just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance. Rice. Now well, they're keeping their opponents moving and guessing. Can he find the net? And a goal! 1 0. And what a fast start they've made to this game. Well, here it is again, and he's just passed that into the net. That's a very good finish, you have to say. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. The referee's letting it go as they keep the ball. Salai. Adam Nudge. Schaefer. Can they trouble the opposition this time? Oh, good play this. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. He's very adept at protecting the ball. He's lost it. Kane. And now it's Phillips. Well, beating his opponent. Oh, just mistimed his run and the flag going up. So Bosloy. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. Well, he's given it away. Sterling. Well, they're quite content to knock it around inside their own half. Well, they keep working away, looking for an opening. 
Oh, good vision. And a goal! Cause for celebrations again. Two in front. Well, as you can see, he gave the keeper no chance there. He looked so confident, didn't he? That's a cool finish. Well, a second goal for them here. So, Bosloy. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Well, England have controlled possession, as you can see, and they've made good use of it. They really have played... Oh, Stuart, they might be onto something here. And he scored not once, but twice. They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. Well, you've got to say, an incredible first-half performance. That scoreline tells you all you need to know. Salai. Botka. Well, the pass not finding its target. Well, approaching half-time on the home side, very much in charge here, Stuart. Your thoughts? Well, what a totally dominant performance this has been so far. Oh, big chance here! And a goal to seal the hat-trick! A masterclass in finishing! Just can't stop him today! Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Salai. And continues his run. And let's give credit to the defending. And the attack fades out. Foden. Here's Mount. Well, the stoppage time situation. One minute here. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Salai. Kleinheisler. Endre Botka. And the referee sees that as a foul. Free kick given. And he whips it in. Well, the clearance, half-hearted. This looks promising. Well, time just challenged magnificently. And they're trying to get right into his face. And given away. Phillips. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. on the back of that well let's take another look and it doesn't come much closer than this does it he just squeezed it in off that post very good finish well not too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things 4-1 Mount Rice with it. And now it's Phillips. Long way out. Well, in actual fact, it ended up being a simple claim for the keeper. Salai. Adam Nudge.
alerts at defending. Well, not giving him any breathing room. And they could face difficulties here. Well, the keeper was called upon and delivered. Well, he's so good in those 1v1 moments, and he's proved it yet again. And time for the change now. Corner kick played in. It hasn't come to very much. And now they have the ball back. So, 20 minutes to go. Really good interception. And it might be superb stop. Substitution time as is here. Over it comes. Can he finish here? And a goal! That's his brace. They just can't keep him quiet. Well, just look at the setup here. It's such a clever back heel. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Well, the seconds are ticking away and the home side in control. Stuart, what have you made of this? Well, I think the scoreline reflects the difference between the two teams. For most of the game, they've dictated the play and they've created some really good chances. I think it's been an excellent performance. Just 10 minutes to go. The cross is on. How can he take them on and beat them? Can he get one back? In it goes! It looked as though they were down and out. Not a bit of it. What will happen next? Well, how about this? 4-3. Shaw. Kane. Declan Rice. And now it's Phillips. And a strong tackle. And we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here. Trailing as they are, they're not likely to get too many opportunities late in this game. Running with the ball confidently. Now a decent position. And possession given away. And there goes the final whistle. And the home fans are going to be happy about this outcome. Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game.